Hey everybody! Okay, so what we are going to be looking at today is some advanced reporting, looking at the map extents within inside your reports. So how do we display multiple maps in a report with the same map extent? Cool, stick with me and let's get to it. Okay, so we have our conservation area open and we have our report open. So on the left hand side here, you've got report items. You've got this item called smart map. So you click and you, this is where you would, for example, add a map to your report. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna make it bigger um, so that it's legible when I run my report. Okay. And this is where we are going to look at the various layers that are going to be added to this map as well as the general format. So if I click on my map, this item is selected. So the properties are assigned. And in this case, I'm going to choose map layers. So at the bottom here, you've got the base map option. So this is your base map that you normally have saved in your map perspective. Now here, you get the map bounds. This is new in Smart 7. So if I click on this, I can set the map extent. So to the extent of the map layers, I can actually set it to a query layer. So if I add a query here that I want to display on the map itself, I can set the extent. So when I run it, the extent of this layer will be zoomed in on the map itself when the report. So that's a very nice new feature. So just to show you what it's like, I'm going to show you an example now. Okay, so I've gone ahead and added two queries um, for human wildlife conflict, attack on livestock and attack on dam uh, attack on livestock and crop damage. I'm going to go and change the style. Okay, I click save. Now I remember I've set the map boundaries to all query layers. So all of these, so whatever extent this is, it's gonna zoom my base map to that. So I'm gonna run my report on all dates, just for the moment, just to view the results. And as you can see, there's my map and the map has zoomed to the extent. You can see here the boundary of the park it's just outside, but this is the extent of the layers of crop damage as well as attack on livestock, which is awesome. So if I want that style to be applied to all my maps, I click on this apply to all option and that map boundary will be with all my specific maps in this report. Or I can set specific queries. So which one I want to focus on or I can actually set a custom, which is the normal way in which you have been able to do it in the past. Awesome. Have, have fun, guys.